would it make sense to wear the club in practice to get used to that, or is that something like? No, nah, the club's out of the equation. Okay, so they, there won't be a club this week. New, no, nah, is, is that a your call or is that coaching staff? Or? It's a, um, it's a bit of both. Okay, after so, last week you decided. Yeah, I'm yeah. done with it. Oh. Well, what we're seeing you wear in practice is what you plan to wear Sunday. Yeah, or some of that nature. Some of that nature. Okay. What? How do you expect your role to change a little bit with Mario not getting any practice in and? Um, we're just waiting to see what, what Mario's going to do, how he's feeling about his situation. And then um, however the coaches play it out, it's kind of what we're going to roll with. Is that tough knowing his circumstances? Yeah, it was, it was tough seeing that and um, hearing about what's going on. Um, I'm going to reach out to him when the time's right and just give my condolences and everything like that. Brian, you guys have been so good rushing the passer all year, but how important is it going to be, especially against this team, to stop the run in order to create pass rushing situations? And you know, with Derrick Henry, they're going to come in here try to establish the run. Um, um, that's going to be very important, honestly. I mean, we got to get, we got to stop the run to get the, to earn the right to rush the passer, and that's what we do best. So, I mean, that's definitely going, that's definitely what we want to do, because um, that's going to play into our strong suit. How is a guy like Bruce Irvin, a veteran guy, kind of coached up you and Christian and other young guys on the D-line? Um, just on really situations, um, technique, just knowledge of the game overall. I mean, he's, he, he has a unique pass rush kind of tandem that he throws together, like in his arsenal. And um, him just showing us that and teaching us that is, is, a, is an amazing thing. Does it feel extra rewarding to see him like miss the first two or three games and then come back and have a game like he did last last week with a safety, a sack, two, two and a half sacks, something like that? Yeah, definitely. I mean, he's been showing it since he, ever since he got back, but I always knew what he could do. I mean, that's, that's not a surprise at all. I was just waiting for him to pop out. And uh, that was a good game to pop out. And now that he's back and he's full force, we can keep it rolling. Coming up on midseason for you, how would you evaluate first half of your first season? Um, first half was good. A um, little slight setbacks, but nothing too serious. I mean, other than I'm not satisfied, but it's all right for now. What do you mean by not satisfied? Uh, I, lost, I left a lot, of field, uh, a lot of plays on the field, but I mean, you can't go back now. You just keep going. Any specifically that stood out, or hmm? any specifically that stood out? Uh, just those close sacks and those close TFLs, like when you like inches away, certain things like that. Game of inches. I mean, that's what it is. So things like that. But um, I could be in a lot worse position. So I'm glad where I am. Brian, obviously, had a tough loss last week, but this is, a, as you know, a room full of professionals that have gone through it before. What have you seen from guys stepping up and kind of the messaging as you head into another week? Uh, honestly, I've just been hearing nothing but positivity. I mean, we're not going to act like last week didn't happen, but um, we can't let that deter or stop us from getting to our destination. So we just got to put that behind us, learn from the film, and keep it moving. When you look at the film of the quarterback you're facing, I mean, it's limited in terms of him with his new team this year in Tannehill, but what do you see and, and what do you guys think you can do to try to get to him? Um, we're not going to change anything, honestly. I mean, we, we rushed the passer well this, this year. I mean, this, this thus far. So we're not going to change anything. We're just going to try to execute on a different level and uh, really get to the quarterback. But we got to stop the run first.